So let's set up a separate Cocos uh, 2D environment, Python environment. And I've created two folders on my desktop. One is uh, Cocos 2D development. This is where the PyCharm uh, project will go and the Cocos 2D environment. So in this environment folder, I'm going to shift and right click and open a command window here and create here a separate uh, Python virtual environment. So we're to our virtual E and V and let's call it Cocos underscore E and V. Cocos ENV, okay. It may take a few seconds to create this uh, virtual environment. And it's done. So here is this environment. If you go into it and into the scripts folder, you have this activate command you need to run to act actually act activate this environment. So CD to cocos env slash script and run the activate command. So now we activated this uh, separate environment, Python environment, and in this environment I'm going to install with pip uh, the pyglet first. So pip install pyglet and it says that successfully installed uh, pyglet version 1.3.2 and also this future package uh, pyglet is uh, it looks like it's dependent on this future. And now let's install the as, um, pip install the cocos to the not to but to the pip install cocos to the so successfully installed cocos to the version 0 0.615 and it also installed this package called 6 so now let's freeze with pip freeze and this show, shows you that in this environment uh, which packages are installed so cocos future pilot and six so now that we have the environment and all the packages we need let's go to pycharm and just create a new project and let's move it to desktop and the Cocos 2D development folder. So OK. And here is project interpreter new virtual environment. And let's let's give it a new virtual environment. So here in the desktop. Desktop and Cocos 2D environment go to the scripts folder and select the python.exe and create in a new window, yes. Okay, this old window, I can close it. So now let's create scanning install packages, okay. Now let's create a new python file. And let's call it 01 and hello cocos. So the first thing we need to do is of course import cocos. Cocos and let's create a simple window, cocos window. So Cocos dot director dot director dot init. Okay, init. 
and let's give it a width so width equals 1280 and let's give it a height which will be equal to 720 and give a caption caption will be my cocos window and uh, let's call the uh, cocos dot director dot director dot run uh, at this point it will give us an error so run it I'll try to run it and it says that missing one required position argument scene so in order to run a cocos application we need at least uh, one scene so I'm just going to create an empty scene uh, let's call it test scene and cocos that scene that scene with a capital S and here in the run give it the test scene so now it should create a window yes it's with this 1280 and its height is 720 and the windows title or the caption is my cocos window Okay, so let's improve it a little bit. I'm going to create a label and with the text of Hello Cocos. So I'm just going to create a class and call it just Hello Cocos. And this class will inherit from the Cocos.layer that layer with a capital L and let's create an init method so init uh, the parentheses of course and let's call the super classes init so super dot init and let's create a label label equals cocos dot text dot label so the first thing will be the text which will be hello cocos the next argument it will be the font name so font underscore name will be uh, times new roman font name let's set the font size also so font underscore size uh, to 32 and i'm going to move it to the next line and let's set the anchor point for the text so anchor x equals center center and anchor underscore y equals also center uh, anchor x anchor y yes we need a comma here after the font size and now I'm just going to create the usual if underscore underscore name underscore underscore equals equals main underscore underscore then indent these lines okay and here before the test scene i'm going to create the hello layer equals hello cocos and give the hello layer object to the scene and now yes 
the uh, important thing also. First, I'm going to just create uh, position the label to the windows width divided by two, which is 640, and also windows height divided by two, which is uh, 360, and add this label to the layer. So self that add the label and now let's run it and as you see we have a window and inside the window we have a layer with the text label text hello hell cocos uh, hell hello cocos hello cocos and I'm also going to just import from cocos the director import the director so because I don't like to always type cocos that director that director here also cocos that director that director so now that uh, that I imported it uh, like so I can delete this cocos that director and also here cocos that director so it's enough just to write director that in it and director that run test scene. I don't know what I'm going to cover in the next video, but I hope you will be there as well. So have a nice day and thanks for watching.